Hello again and welcome back to March Payne's Midlife Dolly Crisis. So today I'm going to be unboxing these. Now these are blind boxes. They are a combination of two of the Rainbow High and one Shadow High um, handbag blind box. So I know these were released quite a while back. I never got any at the time but these were being sold off very cheaply online and um, I didn't want to try them. I, I think handbags all kind of accessories are really useful for dolls and not just for the Rainbow High and Shadow High dolls. The kind of size that these are would work well with Barbie and Cindy and, you know, all those kind of fashion doll size. So that was why I kind of wanted to expand on it. And I was interested to see what they were like, because obviously the quality of Rainbow High and Shadow High and the accessories and, and the clothes are really good. Um, and it was a bargain and, you know, I can't resist a bargain. So... Let's get these open and see. I can't remember, because it was a while ago now, if there was some sort of choice that I had to make with like colours and stuff like that. I think it was literally just buying as, as they were. So I didn't really have any kind of options, I don't think. So yeah, so I've got a Shadow High and two Rainbow High ones. I'm going to open, I think, this one first. And then um, I'll open the Shadow High one and then probably that one. So... On the side of these, now I don't know if this is what you're going to get or this is basically an example of what you could get, but apparently there's there's 25 plus to collect of them. So I think that's just kind of like a selection of what, what you could get, but I think the colour of the box relates to kind of the colour scheme of the bags inside it. So let's open this up. Now, obviously I've not done this before, but I think, okay. So I've gone ahead and removed the plastic that was kind of on them. So they all have the same kind of plastic thing on. So that's all gone. So these should literally be easy to open now. So let's put these ones to one side. Let's open this one first. So it's got like a sticker here, which I guess you have to break to open. I, oh, no, that's good. I didn't have to do that. So there we go. So there is stuff here in the lid. So there's like, I think there's like a certificate and there's like a ticket and I don't know, some sort of label. I'm not particularly bothered with that. That can stay in there for all I, I care at this point. So here is what we've got here. There is a leaflet as they are in all of these sort of blind bag or blind box things, which is basically like a checkoff list to show you what, what you could get um, and what is rare and stuff like that. So I think they're kind of grouped together in the colors that they're gonna be. So there's kind of these kind of green ones here. There's black ones down there and sort of purple ones and so we've got a whole spectrum here going on um, and then I know at the time they also released let me open it up fully so we can see it they also released shoes but I, I didn't get any of those I literally just got the handbags so yeah so this is basically what 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 you could have won um, and this is this is what you have one. So they all come with these, which are, I guess, to keep them in. They, they're quite cute. I'm not really sure what you're meant to do with them afterwards, but um, but yeah, I mean, they might be good for keeping accessories in, I guess, for, for the Rainbow High dolls or whatever, or any dolls, I suppose. Um, you could maybe keep like spare shoes and things like that. Obviously that's when we used to get sort of spare, cost, spare sort of, accessories and outfits and stuff like that with them but yeah so so that is that so let's see which one we've got here i'm guessing it's going to be a blue one okay so this is cute this is obviously a a handbag um and it has got sort of like a faux reptile print on it it kind of it's gray at the sides and then it kind of gradiates into into a blue sort of pattern there um it's got like a plastic handle it does open it's got velcro so you can put things in there that is actually quite cute 
don't know if you can see because it seems to want to focus on anything but the bag obviously because why would it want to do anything else there we go so there, that is that one I will take some pictures of these at the end and I will also put them with various different dolls so you can see what they might look like so that is that one there so we'll put that one off to the side let's open this one so this is the shadow high one it's quite unusual <laughs> it's quite big um, and it's got a chain already hanging out from it again it comes with one of these sort of drawstring bags um, so let's see which one this is I'm guessing it's going to be black but the other one wasn't exactly the colour that I thought it might be Okay, so this is kind of like a sort of a, a football or basketball in black. It's got handles. It's got it's got a gap there. I'm not sure you'd want to put anything in it because you might not get it back out again. Um, it's quite unusual. It might be good for a, a goth doll maybe. That might find it interesting. So there's also um, like there's handles there for them to hold. There's also the chain, which can obviously go over a shoulder. But yeah, I'm quite happy with that. So that is that one. And then finally, we've got this. Again, this one feels quite small. Um, and again, we've got this, which is actually a really nice colour. Um, it's sort of like a sort of a peachy orange. So we'll put that to one side. And let's see which bag we've got here. Oh, lovely. So this is a kind of faux, faux wicker, wicker one, I, I guess, or straw, straw sort of basket thing. Um, this, I recognise this because I know I've seen people with this one and it is actually quite cute. So I'm quite glad I've got that. And you can actually open it as well because it's kind of like a rubber material. So you can open things, open it and put, put things in it. So let's let's have a look at the, the three we've got. So we've got this one here. We have got this, oops, this huge bag here. And then we have got this one here, which was the first one we opened. So we've got two, two kind of smallish bags and then a big one here. I'm actually quite pleased with these. As I say, they didn't cost me a lot, so that's even better. Let me know what you think of them down in the comments below. Keep an eye out at the end because I will actually put them with some dolls so you can see what kind of size they work with. Um, please like the video if you've enjoyed it. Please share the video if you know anyone that would like to see this kind of thing. I mean, I, I know this is, it, these are not recent releases by any stretch. Um, I'm not sure if they're classed as vintage just yet. But um, but yeah, I, I know these were out quite a few months ago, possibly even longer. But obviously, as you know, I'm always late to the party. So, yeah. Also, please subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you next time. As I say, keep an eye at the end and I will get some pictures up as well. So until the next time. Bye.